Howard Cosell. I don't yeah. know how many young people out there are familiar with Howard Cosell, but when I was growing up, he was yep. he was the uh, face of mm -hmm. most sporting events. I mean, it was football, it was heavyweight fighting. Yep. He was everywhere. He was this iconic figure. You got to know him a little bit. You I, met him when you were quite young. I, I did, and, and he was already established as, you know, he was simultaneously this almost cartoonish television personality, but a great journalist who would address the sports issues of the day in a way that most of his colleagues wouldn't. And he had a great relationship with Muhammad Ali, and he did wonderful work, and he also could be just bombastic and ridiculous. So the first time I met him, I walk up to him, I say, hello, Mr. Cosell, my, my name is Bob Casas. It's a pleasure to meet you. And he says, I know who you are. You're the child who rhapsodizes about the infield fly rule. I'm sure you'll have a fine career. And he flicked a cigar ash and walked away. And <laughs> You're the child. Right. My first thought is, this is the biggest schmuck I've ever met. Yeah. But in the next second, I'm thinking, no, this is great. Because I got the full Howard Cosell treatment. Yes, that you know? was the treatment. Well, yeah. you, you know, he craved attention, yeah. apparently, and, and absolutely loved it, but loved to pretend that it was a pain in the ass. Yeah, and what illustrates that is, is this story. His great colleague, Jim McKay, they couldn't have been more different in terms of personality. McKay, the longtime host of Wide World of Sports and the Olympics, did the wonderful, sensitive job during the, the hostage crisis with the athletes in Munich in, in 1972. So after an ABC event, Howard is holding forth in the lobby of the hotel. Makeup still on, hideous yellow jacket still on. The ABC with, sports jacket. Uh, exactly. Yeah. And McKay, in his self-effacing way, comes through the revolving door and is headed for the elevator when he hears, Jimmy, Jimmy, get over here. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, there he is, the diminutive and yet highly esteemed host of ABC's Wide World of Sports, Mr. James McManus, who prefers to be known as Jim McKay. Jimmy, look at this scene. A scene that plays itself out in hotel lobbies, airport terminals, restaurants, city streets, across the length and breadth of this great land of ours. People who want a moment of my time, an autograph, a photograph, my thoughts about sports, oh no, far too mundane, the larger issues of the day. I ask you, Jimmy, where can I go for some sanctuary? Where can I find a moment's peace? And McKay looks up at him and says, Howard, may I suggest your room. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching. Be sure to click subscribe to see even more great Conan clips. You may now return to your pirated movies and creepy Japanese pornography.